Let me show you how to add a brand new tool to your EasyCarve tool database. I've got this brand new tool. I think it's gonna be great for this job when it comes to my finishing toolpath. It's gonna be all kinds of nice detail. When I go to create that toolpath, I'm gonna to choose finishing toolpath, choose the drop down for my tools, and I'm gonna add a brand new tool. At this point, I can go ahead and choose the type. It's a ball nose. I'm gonna choose the, the, the diameter of it, which is a 0.125. I can add in some notes if I'd like to, so I can maybe know where I bought this from. I can add in a custom tool name if I'd like to. I need to now tell it what the feeds and speeds are for this tool. When I do that, I'm gonna be showing the machine that I've chosen in an earlier step. If I'd like to change that machine, I just can use this drop down. It's gonna show the material that I chose in a previous step, or I can choose the material I'd like to from this drop down. I'm gonna go ahead and set this tool up for my Avid CNC machine when I cut softwood, EasyCarve has already given me some conservative feeds and speeds for this tool based on what it knows. I'm just gonna check those over really quick to make sure they're safe and appropriate. And if they are, I can go ahead and add that entry. I can go back to my job and I can choose that tool from my tool dropdown and I can go ahead and calculate my tool path. It's really that easy.